Hey guys, it's Rob and the birds and um, welcome to uh, a little bit of a new show if if you can call it that. I will um, I will just uh, give you guys a quick channel update every Saturday so if you like uh, to know what's going on with my channel and with the Project Brutality campaign and with Project Brutality itself or with, with my personal life or hell anything I, I can do some Q&A I, uh, I, I like to, uh, to get you guys up to date every Saturday so that's, uh, that's gonna be some kind of a weekly series I guess um, yeah first of all thank you guys so much for all your great support my channel actually went to a kind of a rough patch lately but I will, I will uh, talk about that a little more uh, uh, in a moment, um, but yeah, it, it actually regained uh, regained all of its subscribers and view counts and stuff, and the reactions are just overwhelming. So you guys might have already noticed, probably already, but I started the face cam. Um, for I do that like a little more than a week now, and yeah, I was of course a little bit uh, nervous to do that at first. I mean. Trying new things is always a little bit scary, but you guys' uh, reactions are just were just overwhelming, man. Um, the the comments were great. The like to dislike ratio was just absolutely amazing. I mean, my first facecam video has now 91 likes and one dislike, so that really tells me that you guys like what I'm doing. So, yeah, thank you, uh, thank you so much for your feedback and all your nice comments. But that brings, uh, that brings me on the following. Um, the reactions were very positive. The, uh, the li like to dislike ratio was amazing. But my channel was actually dying lately. That was really weird. I mean, fluctuations in subscribers are normal with YouTube. I mean, sometimes YouTube just deletes uh, inactive accounts and something or something. And it messes with your statistics a little. Uh, so at first I thought... Maybe it was because um, um, because of that, you know. Um, but it act, but it kept going, and it. I was uh, usually when I lose subscribers, it's like two, and then I gain five, and then I lo lo maybe lose another lose another one, and then gain two. But it's really uh, sometimes I go up way high, and sometimes I uh, I it's it goes up in little bits of ups and downs but it goes up but lately my subscriber got literally did this it was it was very scary so not uh, not not because i uh, i thought power that those those fluctuations weren't normal but because it didn't make any sense to me at first i mean uh, i tried new things and really f uh, from pretty much that moment that started all happening but the reactions were positive so i didn't know what was wrong and I was thinking about YouTube recently changed this policy about swearing and, uh, uh, and and violent content. Well, I play fucking Doom and I swear like a bastard. So I thought that 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 had maybe something to do with. I still have no idea what what that was. So if somebody in the comment section knows what what might have caused that, um, please tell me. But uh, I still don't know, but it, it, uh, my, my channel was gaining subscribers again, and it's, it's all good, so never mind, that's a thing of the past, I, uh, I think. Further, in my personal life, I, uh, I have some great changes coming up, I, uh, <coughs> pardon, I, um, I mentioned a few times before that I might, uh, that I might move uh, quite soon, and it looks like that's gonna be this month. Yes, I'm gonna actually gonna move in February. I'm still gonna have one room uh, in that house, and this uh, I I I I I, uh, I will have two roommates, which are great friends of mine already. So that's gonna be fun. Really looking forward to that, and I can work on a on a better setup in uh, in my new room there. But it's it's a smaller room that I have now actually. But uh, I will make that work. But yeah, you know we are the parakeets constantly uh, in the background, and just because I only have one room again, and it's really going to be difficult to have the parakeets, sadly, because I really don't have any much any decent room for it. And sleeping with parakeets on your room, 
don't do it guys it is incredibly unhealthy i didn't uh, i didn't notice any health problems yet but it's, uh, the the amount of dust particles and birds have some special kind of they, their skin are like ours, so they have really those weird kinds of, I don't know how to describe them, but they, they are just very unhealthy, so. The parakeets are untamed, so I, I ain't that close to them. Of course, I have I had them for four years, so I, I will greatly miss them, but uh, I decided it's best to bring them to somebody I know, give them a good home, and uh, yeah. The parakeets are probably going away guys, so yeah, I'm not sure how much you guys would care, but uh, I, I, get, uh, I get the parakeets mentioned in the comment section a lot, so uh, yeah, so that's uh, that's what's going on. Uh, then I have the, an, another uh, another thing that I have to, that I really want your guys' opinion on. It's again that Subnautica let's play. Um, you might have known, I, I already recorded another episode like days ago, but to be honest guys, you guys always say uh, do what you love and I really love that game, but I don't really love recording that game to be honest. It is really that kind of game you want to just just relax, you know, be uh, turn, turn, turn on your great sound. Uh, I mean, I have a pretty cool surround uh, speaker set, which I, which I made myself. And it sounds fantastic. Um, and yeah, th this is maybe it's very uh, selfish of me, but it's it, I really don't feel like uh, like I, I I'm making a good let's play, and and I really don't enjoy recording it as much as I do play it. So Doom is a total different score uh, story. I I love playing that, but I I I, I don't want to uh, play. W just Doom. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's still gonna be a Doom-oriented channel and I'm gonna play many more Doom mods. I'm gonna play as much ones as I can with Project Brutality. I'm gonna play Complex Doom, which I, believe it or not, never played before, so everything is gonna be a complete new surprise for me. I didn't try it on purpose because I really wanted to have that surprise factor in my Let's Play. I'm gonna play Winter's Fury again. I have some very funny mods that I'm thinking about. Maybe you guys have some more suggestions. I mean, feel free to uh, to suggest any stuff. But uh, and I will play Dusk. I will play Quake at some point. I played Doom 3 recently. I maybe may I'm gonna play Serious Sam or Painkiller, or maybe some completely different games. I I to be, uh, I actually recorded the hardest game ever. That's that very popular Flash game, which drove me fucking nuts. I recorded that yesterday, it will probably go up and uh, very soon. It's just an hour of me yelling and losing my mind, so if you enter that. So yeah, just be honest guys, I really don't feel like uh, like continuing that Subnautica let's play, but on the other hand, I also feel like if you start something, you should finish it. But I really don't think much, many people miss it, I mean, it barely gets any views. And that that's not the reason why I why I why I stop it, but it also tells me from if if I stop, there won't be many people who miss it now. But if I continue it and don't like it, and I and I gain more views uh, for those, then I really have no way no way back. I feel like so. I think I just want to cancel that. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna cancel that let's play for now. And I keep it like that, un un unless you guys really uh, convince me uh, to, to continue it. But consider the last play cancelled from now on. Um, but if you really, really like to see it, just spam me with comments from please bring webs to bed to Nordica. If you don't want to see it, just don't mention it and it's, it's that then. So yeah, that's the way I feel about that. I'm sorry about those parakeets by the way. I like to get them involved a little bit now, but uh, yeah, they're quite noisy now. So yeah, I apologize, I actually wrote up some, some things to talk about, because I really hate missing anything. Um, let's see, yeah, you also may notice that I uh, started to uh, to do some, some funny edits in my videos. I still like to be the, uh, the pure gameplay, so I won't cut any gameplay out. Um, 
It's just to give you the full experience of the game. And those, don't worry that those editing things, it will be just uh, funny, uh, funny cutaway jokes. Like, it, it's it's really not gonna dominate my videos at all. It's just pure gameplay and if I have a, a funny thing to say with a funny clip. I mean, most of those new videos have like four clips put into them or something. And that's, uh, that is really how it's gonna stay. I, I, I'm not gonna do any heavy editing. Which brings me on another few questions. Uh, don't laugh at me, please. Although I totally would deserve it, but the video editing software I'm using at the moment is Filmora from from And that's a good pro. It's, it's a pretty good program uh, for very simple things, but it's really limited, guys. So. Of course, the best software would be like things like uh, Adobe Premiere, uh, uh, Adobe After Effects, or uh, like every YouTuber uses uh, um, Sony Vegas. But um, Sony Vegas, I mean. Um, but it's um, those programs are pretty expensive, and I know some people say just just put a crack on it. But I I stopped doing that long time ago, man. I really want to be honest. And um, Sony Vegas is awesome, but it's, f I mean, for the simple kind of edits I do, it's really not necessary. And that motherfucker costs like $600. I'm not sure how much it's gonna cost me in euros, but it's not exactly a cheap program. So, if you guys have any, um, any hints for me for like under 100 euro uh, for a program, which, which is really helpful for let's play and those f quick funny... Uh, I mean, letting things bounce, uh, putting some animations in it sometimes, that's something I really want to do sometime. Again, not too heavy, just like a funny joke. Yeah. For, like, for example, like stupid things, like I'm saying a game can't harm me and then a fireball shoots, uh, shoots at me or something. Just just funny, simple things like that. Do you guys know any uh, uh, affordable program to do that? Um, yeah. I think uh, that's about it, guys. Uh, I, I'm going Oh no, wait. I uh, I forgot one thing. Uh, I uh, of course, what you guys really I I get uh, questions for it uh, very very frequently actually. How is the Project Brutality campaign doing? I will uh, I will talk about that every week too. Just the progress on it, but. I really don't want to disappoint you guys. I mean, we're still uh, working on it. Don't worry, but it it goes a little slow at the moment, and the work that has been done on it is is more is mostly on maps. You're not allowed to see that, so I really can't share anything. There is still awesome stuff in the making. Don't worry about that. Um, but yeah, the, the computer problems of the lead developer are still present and he is really thankful for the Patreon support you guys gave him. So if you want to help him uh, to have a decent uh, PC for that kind of stuff, just... I mean, he, he will close that, that Patreon when, the, when he has that PC. We already told you that. We're not, we're not in it for the money at all. But at this moment, he is literally making it on a very crappy 8-year-old laptop that's that's about to die. And if you see the kind of stuff he's making, um, that's not doable, man. It's just not doable. And he still does it, but it's really <laughs> eating away and it's, and it's patience. And I really understand that, man. So, um, yeah, there, is, uh, there isn't really a lot uh, of stuff uh, I, I, uh, I can share. I mean... I, I will I, I know I keep saying it but I will uh, continue uh, production on the soundtrack as well but I'm really uh, I was really busy with my YouTube account and with with the things uh, that uh, that I had to uh, that I had to do for moving and stuff I had work I had uh, I had seven tests at school so I I really have been busy so I will resume that uh, as soon as I, uh, I as I think it it feels right so yeah. I'm sorry if I just ramble on. I mean, really, the point of this is just me talking to you guys, telling me, uh, telling you guys what is going on in the dev team, what's going on in, in with my channel, and what's going on in my personal life. So, yeah, thank you guys uh, so much for all your great support. Thank you for watching, and I will uh, try to con uh, continue making as much uh, quality content as I can.
and hopefully you guys will like it and watch it so thank you guys so much you are the best and i will see you in the next video laters guys